cut down but fully functional version of Cakewalk's flagship Rapture Pro sample based synth, Rapture Session costs $30 in the shops but is yours for free only with this issue of Computer Music. Loading as a VST or Audio Units plugin on PC and Mac, Rapture Session is powered by a 3.2GB bank of multi samples and wavetables, all taken directly from the full 11GB Rapture Pro library, covering everything from pianos and guitars to synths, strings, atmospheres, and more. Before we walk through installing and using Rapture Session, let's take a quick tour of the preset instruments. Having entered the code from the magazine into the CM Giveaway landing page and created a Cakewalk user account, the first step in the installation process is to download Cakewalk Command Center, which serves as a hub for all your Cakewalk products. Get it for Mac or PC at cakewalk.com and run the installer once it's downloaded. Launch and log in to Cakewalk Command Center using your account username and password, and you'll see Rapture Session as an available product in the left hand column, complete with its five sound libraries. Click Install All to download and install the whole lot in one go. With Rapture Session installed, call it up in your VST or Audio Units host like any other plugin instrument. The interface launches with the browser open. This comprises three hierarchical columns and an info panel, the last giving details of the current instrument program, including the number of times it's been loaded before. Navigate the browser by selecting one of the 12 instrument types, then loading a program from it. Use the left and right buttons above to step through adjacent programs, and enter text into the search field to hunt down sounds by name. Clicking the star button in the info panel marks the current program as a favorite, filtered into the favorites bank.
Click the instrument button to reveal the controls for the current program. The eight knobs are hardwired macros controlling an array of under the hood parameters. Upgrading to Rapture Pro gives full access to all of them. The macros are self-explanatory, presenting an appropriate range of tweakable options for each instrument, from filter cutoff and resonance to detune, effects and more. The eight macros can be assigned to a MIDI controller for hands-on operation. If you know the MIDI CC output by the knob on your controller, right-click a macro, select Add MIDI Control and choose it from the list. If not, select MIDI Learn and move the knob to automatically assign it. Every program also features one or two XY pads, hardwired to control two parameters each, one on the X axis, the other on Y, including various effects modules. Drag the crosshair around for real time modulation. Adjust the speed knob to alter the movement acceleration rate. and assign each parameter to a MIDI controller by right-clicking and invoking MIDI Learn. The Vector Mixer enables user control blending of the up to six separate sample and wavetable-based elements that are mixed together to create each program. Each point on the hexagon represents an element, and moving the MIDI assignable crosshair mixes them, with adjustable acceleration via the speed knob. Rapture Pro, of course, lets you get your hands on the elements themselves in great detail. Finally, at the right-hand end of the interface, the output section contains level and pan controls and an optional soft limiter for preventing clipping. If you like what you hear from Rapture Session, head over to the Cakewalk website and download the demo of its big brother, Rapture Pro.